movie's a love story. The movie follows um, these two characters, Rachel Weisz and, and my character, and it spans over a thousand years. But uh, really, I think what the movie's about is, at some point, in order to live your life to the full, you also have to come to terms with the fact that we're going to die. And the, the more okay you are with that, the better you're going to live your life. And uh, I think it's about connecting. The film is about not just getting caught up in the details of life, but actually just dropping things and going for a walk, smelling the roses. Don't worry. We're almost there. Well, you know, you try to create professional life and a personal life. And when me and Rachel work together on the fountain, we try to, uh, you know, try to separate it and be as professional as we can. She's such a tremendous actor, and the performance she gives on the fountain is just mind blowing. So I could only be proud every day. Together we will live forever. You know, it was that we filmed the movie for three months. So during the duration of the film, I got to see Darren, the director, as a director. And I never met the director before. I think the person that you you are at work is a very different person that you are in the kitchen in the morning making eggs before you go to work. You know, so very different. He's like a, it's very, you know, he's very in charge. He's very in control. You know, as a woman, it's very uh, sexy to see your fella be uh, really, you know, good at what he does. You know, women like talent. That's what we like. Well, it's a little strange when we had a bit of a sex scene. And he said, listen, I just want you to start kissing. And then so we start kissing. About a minute goes into it, and we're still kissing. So she takes off my shirt. And around about this point, I'm getting to about second base. And I'm thinking, he's going to call cut any minute. He doesn't. And uh, before we knew it, uh, you hear this voice from five feet away, like, take his pants off, Rachel. Take his pants off. 